a highly personalized audio device that measures the user's hearing, a smart all-in-one control center, room climate control through a smartphone. The Internet of Things is making life easier. IoT solutions are front and center at the world's largest electronics market in Hong Kong. A classic example, an ingeniously devised smart cup from Hong Kong's Tinson. Nowadays, people always go to gym. They're concerned about their health and they uh, focus on uh, keeping them, their body in shape. And we want to do is to have a cup that can track what they drink, how much calories they consume every day. The cup inside has uh, many sensors like pressure sensors and some touch sensors to sense the human behavior like how they drink. And then uh, we have an application which has a very large database, contains a lot of strings. We have a lot of international buyers which uh, we can exhibit here and expose our ideas and products. From monitoring our health to relating to family and friends, say hello to the smart Wi-Fi photo frame called Nixplay Seed, which can share photos via a dedicated app developed, designed and promoted in Hong Kong for the international markets. The technology is multifaceted. You see a bit of hardware, but the hardware is only the final piece of the puzzle. 90% of the, the work in the platform is cloud-based, software-based. Smartphones, cloud, and then frames. We originally had a non-connected range of products under the brand name Nix, and then when we decided to become connected, we went with Nix Play to differentiate. And we liked Seed as a model name because for us, Internet of Things, something that grows and changes. And, and so we thought Seed felt very organic. It just seemed like a good fit. We've always been direct sellers ourselves. So we've never had the need to go to a show as sellers, exhibitors. And this is our first year. And to be honest, we've been blown away. It's fantastic. We haven't stopped for a single minute. Uh, there's buyers from everywhere, it's, it's really kept us busy. We have heritage from foreign country, but here's where sort of about 80% of our staff. We've got a lot of hardware guys, a lot of software guys. Uh, so, so Hong Kong is our center of gravity operationally. The thing about IoT, it's got to be software and hardware. Software you can be in a lot of places. Hardware in consumer electronics, there generally is only one place to be. And, and, and Hong Kong, it is the perfect uh, place to be given that you, know, you need a bit of software, you need a bit of hardware. So you don't want to be in Shenzhen, you want to be in Hong Kong. Offerings like these put consumer needs and desires at the heart of advancing technologies. Innovation comes from all angles at the HKTDC Hong Kong International Electronics Fair Autumn Edition 2015, certainly where it comes to robotics. The fair and concurrent Electronic Asia connects visitors with over 4,100 exhibitors with highlights including the new robotics and Internet of Things zones with their many applications and devices. The fair features a conference on how the Internet of Things revolution benefits business and has global player Philips taking light beyond illumination. In the old world of what you think of lighting, it always has been a very functional. You need light because you cannot see anything if you don't have it, so it's darkness and light. And what we are saying today is lighting is a lot more fun and creative and it creates a lot more atmosphere for you rather than just very functional. So on the consumer side, we have launched Hue, which is a platform where you use internet smartphone that you can control the lighting at your home. And this is something that is very embracive to convenience, you know, the lifestyle of Hong Kong people, for example. Obviously, the IoT is a very huge platform and lighting is one industry where IoT can merge with lighting. Everything is very connected, so lighting is just one part of it, but you have other electronics products that all obviously always part of the ecological platform. So yeah, it's definitely very important that all industries are embracing the same platform. The many visitors at the fair's new smart tech zone bears testament to where high-tech is heading on that increasingly busy platform.